<laughs> Hello, Bahamas. Here we are out on the boat. We came looking for Byron, looking for the plane. We came out from 12 o'clock. We found them, found uh, pieces of the plane already, right off of the beach. The boys are now pulling up. Uh, I think they said they found pieces of the battery. Uh, and I'll show you what we have found so far. Yeah. I don't know how to turn the camera on. I'm horrible at this stuff. How do I do that? Can I turn the camera on? Okay, so I'm going to go like this. Here's the pieces that we found so far. Um, before everybody says that I'm inconsiderate, I've already spoken to Anya. And she is fully aware. And um, I already had my cry out session. We are still looking for the actual um, cabin we found. So it seems to be like pieces of the nose and the wing. Here's the battery coming up. And very heavy. We had 17 volunteers. And um, these boys are really working. Let me tell you, they brought their snorkeling gear. I'm going to show you the paperwork that we found. Um, here's his name. I don't know if you could see that. But Byron Ferguson. From Customs. From Customs, West Palm. He supported the, the flight. That's his number, 8559423. I thought they said that this wasn't, um, what did they say? They, it wasn't, uh, they didn't have a flight plan? Yeah, they, it, that's what they said. Is this a flight plan? I don't know. Um, looks pretty flight planish to me. Here, all the guys. Everybody say hi. Hello. Working Hello. hard. Yeah, yeah, They're taking a break. I'm not going to be too much of a slave driver, but they've been diving in this very, very deep ocean. There's a lot of ocean out here. And um, we all have one common goal. I'm a wife, and I'm a, I'm a mom. Anya, I'm, I'm with you, and we will keep looking until the sun set. We're gonna keep looking because I, I, I know that he's out there, and the, the reputation that he has. If so, we're gonna keep looking until we find what all we can find, and. Um, it's, it's been it's been amazing because when we came out here I think that um, we were only a few literally um, Andrew how far were we from the actual coordinates from when they said the plane landed from when we found the first piece? we were about 250 feet no 600 feet 600 feet in depth or weight? I don't know oh, wait. depth was between 79 the so the de the depth of the ocean where we found pieces is about 79 feet and about 600 feet from where the plane landed and if you see look how close we are to the land so literally where they said the plane landed we came out and you know I feel bad now because the boat just got put in the water today we came out and we found the plane and we had this confidence where we were like we're going to find this plane and nothing is better just like when we do hurricane relief, there's nothing better when people come together and one goal and in and, and one mission to say we're gonna find this plane. And when when the the the, the first diver, you know, we everybody do we got in buddies and everybody jumped in the water and they went teams of two and they said um, they're gonna like you know, I don't know about the water. That's what Andrew does. That's his job. And they did. They set up and they said they're going two teams of twos, and they separated. And I have some videos because some of these they, they they go far away from the boat, and I'm sitting there going, Lord, I can't even see them. And so everybody was in charge of who was watching who in the ocean, and it was twelve of them. And when you see that first person was like, hey, and they found something, that's an amazing feeling because I, I was sitting in the boat going. We come out here and find a plane. You believe that? We come right out here and these boys found the plane. And I would just like to say, um, 
I know we have the media here from JCN. Um, there's one. Hey, woo -woo. And it's funny because I didn't even know they just showed up to the dock. And I was like, who are you and you're wearing jeans? You can't dive. And one of the best listen, listen. And he's like, but he's one of the best swimmers. But the cameraman, I'm, I'm going to give him a shout out. Ray, who, look at him. Ray stripped naked. Because he wanted to see for himself and went over with the GoPro. And it was funny because he was like, I want to see for myself. I was like, shoot, I want to see. So I made Andrew go overboard because I said, you need to see because you can be my eyes. And then um, I know Duran has good footage too with his camera. Um, but as you can see, once again, for those who didn't get to see, here's what we found so far. Um, here is the uh, actual engine specs. Uh, some wires. I don't know anything about a plane. Uh, but there's some wires. A lot of pieces. Um, there's a piece down here that's really shaped like the nose. This piece here? Oh, there's the point thing there. See? I don't know what that, what is that piece there? I didn't, yeah. And there's a camera in there. You see that? Like, oh, that's a light. Uh. Yeah. It, it's, it's the boy, so. Here over board. There's Jamie. Facebook Live. Hello. <laughs> so I know everybody's watching and everybody wants me to keep going, but my phone is dying. So we are going to move over because I don't know we were close to the edge or something and I'm, I'm trying to learn the lingo but um, what they're trying to do is use their analysis of the stuff the lighter stuff that was that should have float obviously drifted further away and then the heavier stuff like the battery which obviously when that landed that landed that, that wouldn't float and it took three men to lift that battery so we're going to go in between the two points to see um, what else we see. But you all know the ocean is wide. We're going to continue to look for him. And um, the boys are really excited because, um, you know, we had a good talk before. And it just, it's, everybody is very, very happy. And just so, you know, we know that the family, just so they know that... It really did happen. The, the plane didn't magically disappear like they made it seem, you know. So I'll be back. And um, once again, here's all the boys. Uh, here's everybody. Working on. Look at my good husband. My one good husband. That's that's how I get on this boat. Because let me tell you something. It was my husband. I was gonna learn how to dive today. So we'll be back, okay? I'm going to let my phone charge a bit, and I'm going to come back, all right?